We'll see some changes at this weekend's game against Tennessee. This comes after the university reported more than 20,000 fans went to last Saturday's home opener. But now the students were seated and many without masks. It raised concerns over social distancing. Here's Brittany Kleinpeter to explain the changes you will see on Saturday. People have been talking about the UGA versus Auburn game since Saturday, but much of the focus was on what happened off of the field. ESPN cameras captured some students who were maskless or not social distancing. We all just kind of scream. We're like, oh my goodness, no one's wearing a mask and they're all really close together. Although university officials say the majority of fans wore masks and followed social distancing guidelines, they did admit the student section concerned them. That's why fans will see changes ahead of Saturday's home game against Tennessee. Student seating will be redistributed to allow more space between seats. An athletics department official says additional staff in the student section will also enforce social distancing rules. The expected changes have drawn mixed reactions from students. Uh, ask for something that's not going to happen. I don't think it'll change anything. I think I'm going to go see how it ends up watching TV live for, for the whole game. And if it looks much better, then I might consider it because my friends and I, we really want to go. And game day, it's really exciting here on campus. I don't really think they have that much to worry about. But again, it's a pandemic and you want to keep people safe and the liability issue. UGA is organizing seats together by pods, which includes four people sitting together per pod. They say they are also following all SEC guidelines. The policy requires fans to wear their mask inside of the stadium, but they can take it off once they are seated. So we will see what happens coming up this weekend. As, as Brittany mentioned, that the uh, organizing the seats by pods is the way to go, but we'll see how that works coming up.